Hello, I'm Andrew Lissin. Welcome back to Let's Try Duskers. We're moving on in the world. We're going over to an auto trade number 14 trading post. It's not a ship. So, you know, that'll be something new for us to try out. It's volatile, so there will be, you know, possibility of falling apart like the last one did. Um, two types of infestation. Okay, now be the last of our propulsion, unless we start using our emergency propulsion backup supply. Emergency state martial law. Due to military and biological threats, an intrasystem non-military travel will be required trekking at the sentry post. All inter-system non-military travel has been suspended. All galactic trade routes and civilian communications be active. Okay. Um, okay. I didn't mean to do this. What? Oops. Okay, I want to board. Let's a quick look at our drone config. We've got a trap over here, we've got a lure over here. Gatherer motion, gatherer tow interface. That seems fine. Okay. I'm good to board. Wait. What? Oh, this is actually, like, they actually do trading. It isn't something you need to go in and, like, look at. They actually do trading. They genuinely trade you. So do I, like, sell my propulsion here? Yeah, I sell my propulsion. I can sell my jump fuel. Long-range scanner. Remote power transporter. Teleport sensor. Sensor? What is sensor? What is teleport as well as a drone upgrade? Sensor as opposed to motion detector. I'm really intrigued. It's only three scrap. We might we could buy it. I really want to. <sighs> Go on then. I bought it. So they are actually a genuine trading outpost. I thought it would just be a different type of thing. Objectives. Grey goo, hey you, war. Let's look. Grey goo, station scan. Given assumed advances in nanotechnology, molecular assemblers pose a definitive ex existential risk. Interactive structures like the derelicts themselves uh, make this uh, less likely, but it's possible programming could organic substances could explain this. A thorough scan of vessels with a reasonable amount of organic life might turn up traces of nanotechnology. Scanning rooms of Class A or Class B space stations should provide an adequate sample set. So scanning all rooms of a Class A or Class B space station. Okay. Hey you. Stuck outside last night. Thought of you up there. Must be stuck without me. I want to send you a message. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. War. It seems plausible that military threats such as weapon of mass destruction could have caused a rapid decline in human population, which then triggered a host of other crises. Uh, military communication would prove pertinent in supporting our con contradicting the execution of such an event. Security measures from within a military vessel would likely be less stringent. Locating a military vessel on the interface of the ship systems. Okay, we did that. Defense data. Most of the data from a military vessel has been severely degraded, but it seems that there was communication from a defense outpost regarding prototype. It's so weak. Uh, it's a weak link at best, but we could recover the name of the exact outpost, so priorities... We could not recover the name of the exact outpost, so prioritize other objects above the pond. If they will board any defense outpost and interact with the local terminal. None of these are defense outposts, though. Okay. So we have an issue now, right? We could jump, or we could use some of our backup propulsion fuel to go and have a look at the private vessel over here, or the military vessel here. If we keep going on, it's going to get harder. So I'm actually going to use some of my backup fuel, which I probably shouldn't do, right? But I'm doing it because I want to have a little bit more practice at the lower levels. Um, in terms of like min-maxing, it's not a good idea, because you want your backup fuel for when you need you look like no jump fuel, and you've got to keep looking for propulsion. Uh, however, I kind of think that I need the more practice so I don't screw up at high levels. Um, having a quick look at our drone configs, actually. Sensor. Aaron, can I give you a sensor? Drone 
drop a sensor. So it actually like drop drops the sensor? That's that's really interesting. Okay. We've only got one space left, which is on Cory. I'd actually prefer to have two spaces left. I could drop a trap or a lure. Honestly, I feel like dropping the trap for the moment. I'm gonna empty that. Colin can have a spare space. In fact, Colin can now have the lure. There we go. Right. Let's jump. And I'm on the board. Go for it. Two types of infestation, hull integrity, medium. Found emergency note, a trading post. Will a term... Okay, we know that room three is amazing. And it's got an airlock. And all the doors are closed. And we can transport into room two. But all the doors are open at room two. Okay. Come on, Aaron. Open A1. Go. Airlock up here. There's more things here. There's an air vent. There's an interface. There are some infestations that can travel through the air vent, so quickly gather while we're here. Gather. What does that say? Recommended command info. Info. Power inlet. Use generator to power. Ship upgrade. Transporter used to... Okay, so it's got a transporter. Okay, um, who's my tow? Kelly. Tow. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Right, so decisions, decisions. Um, I think what I will do is I might go dock over the other side and remotely power R2 and leave a couple of people in R2. I mean, we can actually always go in through A5. So actually, the, the transportation here is useless to us. So let's navigate everyone into R2. Navigate everyone into R2. Sorry, navigate all into R2. <laughs> Then we're going to close airlock one. Then I want to remotely power R2. Wow, that's a lot. That's everything. That's everything on the map, actually. We've got control over everything now. Close D8. Uh, don't need to close D11 or D12 because we've already checked them. In fact, let's close D uh, D4 because I want R4 because it's got a grate. It's not secure. Um, I would need to um, get our interface, who's our interface is Kelly, into R5, so if we can navigate Kelly into R5, navigate uh, 1 to R5, and then interface, ship, scan. Okay, let's turn on the defences. Open D14, open D6, open D8. No one? Okay. Now what we can do is we can go dock at R10. I think this is probably a really good idea because we know that R10 is empty and we can move from there. I would like to do a motion scan in R5, however. So let's get Aaron into R5. So navigate 4 into R5. And then I would like to do a motion. Actually, I'd like to do it with someone stationary. I'd actually like Colin to come in. 
navigate two into R5. Motion two. R6. D13. Come on, go into R7. Oh, you cheeky sod. There we go. Go into R10. Go on. Go on. Yes, okay. We now know these two rooms are empty. So we can go check over R6, we can go check over R7. This is really, really good for us. Um, so... D21, please. There's an interface. Okay. Um, close D21, just to make sure. Nothing down here. And there's an interface. Okay, so there's two interfaces down here. There's also a weak transporter lock. Um, okay. Open D21. Open D20. Uh, I would like Kelly to go and interface in this room, just to try and grab as much information as possible. Do a ship scan from here, I guess. D20. D21. Interface. Ship scan. D13. Interface. Ship scan. Okay. So that's that middle room. I can't tell what the number is. I really can't. All right, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's R8. Now, that's a small bug, actually. I guess it's a bug. It's not really a bug. Um, but it's impossible to really tell what that is under that icon. So that's R8, it must be. We can't tell what R8 or R9 have got in them. And in fact, our motion sensor set off because we just... Uh, did we poke Colin or something by mistake? I can't tell. Let's open up D7. Room 2 is losing the transport signal. That's fine. Okay, let's move everyone back to D90, uh, room... F Five. So navigate all room five. We're going to start closing off doors. Oh, we've got a signal in room seven. We should actually make room seven our base then, really. Yeah, let's make room seven our base because we can always transport. Can you transport out? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Okay, let's interface in here as well. Now, we really need to do a scan of R8. So let's do a motion scan. We just killed someone in R11. Okay. Motion, who do you want to use? We're gonna use Colin. Lost video signal from Drone 3. We lost video signal from Colin? No, from Cory. Oh god, Cory, no! Okay, got the video signal back. 
Um, let's close off sections now. Uh, I'm going to turn off the defenses. I'm going to open D8. And I'm going to send Aaron in. D15. Gather. Monday propulsion. Excellent. And a jump cell. Totally worth it. Totally worth it. Okay. Now the question is R3, which has a deactivated drone, R9 and R8. Can't confirm them. Let's transport a signal in room 2. That's fine. Let's transport a signal in R7. We haven't got a lot of time here. This place is going to de like deconstruct. Deconstruct. Break. I could flood all the rooms in radiation, but that would lose whatever we've got in R9 and R8. And R3 is the one I really want. I'm going to use a motion from... Didn't manage to confirm anything. Okay. Open D14. Risk it for the biscuit. Okay. Info. Uh... Mouse. Drone mouse destroyed. Use swap to exchange. What have you got? A trap. Okay, it's worth stuff if I break it apart for scrap. Let's open D16. Okay, and open D7. Okay, the entire place is empty. Right, close D7. Close D16. D16. Close D15. Close D14. Open D18. Open D7. Open D16. Uh, navigate all into R3. Let's dock at A3. Let's close D16 when everyone has passed. D7. D18. Who's got spare space? Cory. I'd like you to swap. Take the trap. I'd like to open A3. And I would like to get the hell out of here. Everyone. Go, 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 go. Now, there's a lot of use of motion scanners that weren't completely necessary in that level. But other than that, I'd say it was a good level. No one got injured. Right, close the airlock. And uh, exit. We got all the propulsion stuff. Not much, like, you know, else. We only got two scrap. But we got a lot of the fuel. Motion deteriorating on Druton 2. Brake probability 17.1%. Hmm. Okay. Ship config. We can use... Uh, Transporter. We already have a transporter. So thank you very much, but no thank you. Okay. I'm happy with that. I'm very happy with that. We're going to jump system, I think. Um, I don't really want to do any modifications. Oh, I do, actually. Uh, I want to actually go to... Ship upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Trap. Because I think I have two traps now, don't I? Yeah, I'm going to convert some to scrap. Execute. Got 20 scrap now. Um, you know, with 20 scrap, I should start modifying the drones. Yeah, I really should start making them better. Aaron is going to get tankier. Aaron needs to get tankier. Cory. Repair the drones' failing video signal. I guess we kind of need to. Kelly, you're okay. Colin, you're okay. Corey, let's repair the video signal. And let's also increase the HP by 10. This is only three scrap, but now we have Corey at above 90 HP, which is I need. Someone was telling me that there's a, uh, um, a jumpy attack infection who just like sits in a room. You can't even motion scan them. And when you go in, they jump at you and do 90 HP damage. So I'm a bit paranoid about having less than 90 HP on a drone. Um... So, we're good now. 
Cory's video signal's being repaired, although I don't really do much with Cory by video signal, and I think it's time to jump to the galaxy map. Um, two, there we go. Right, I got a choice. I can go here for one jump cell or here for two. I'm gonna go here for one jump cell. Easy. Bam! Okay, what's in the system? We have a salvage A, private B, military A, space station D. It's hazardous though, and we don't know the number of infestation types. Oh, it's really tempting to go there. Um, salvage B and a tech B. Okay. I'm really tempted to go to the space station because we have been told we should go to space stations and stuff. But it is hazardous. Who's the closest? You're two. You're two. Honestly, I'm liking the idea of going to here because it's two and then jumping here for one. Yeah. Jump here for two. Jump here for one. Seems like a good plan. But anyway, I've been Andrew Elysium. That's going to be a, a tough mission ahead. If you enjoyed, please remember to like. Not subscribe. Please consider subscribing. But until next time, stay shiny.